Hi, I'm Mike Scott, Superintendent of the Hillsborough School District. I oftentimes say that education is a team sport. Today we're here at McKinney Elementary. We're here to learn about the importance that community partners play in the education of our students. I'm here with Justin Welch, Principal at McKinney Elementary. Justin, can you tell us how community partnerships have benefited both your staff, your parents, and your, and your students, of course? Yeah, absolutely. Um, three main things I want to talk about. First off is in the typical school day, we kind of need to go beyond the traditional classroom setting and even the traditional hours of that school day. And so we need community partnerships to do that, mm -hmm. as well as families and students need additional resources that we haven't really been typically able to provide, um, such as food, clothing, um, community resources and supports. And also, uh, we need those partnerships in order for those to really happen anything that has been kind of considered extra in the past, maybe STEM enrichment, for example, or um, after school programs. Whether it's they're doing um, a video conference with astronomers, we've got one coming up that's with um, oceanographer, um, and then when the kids are actually hands-on with our Corvo volunteers, for example, um, creating rockets and creating different engineering um, exercises and, and really getting their hands involved in the learning, then it's that's when the magic happens. All right, Jennifer has been in the district for 10 years. She's currently serving as STEM coach and instructional coach. Jennifer, can you talk to us about the difference that community partnerships have made in the STEM experience of your students? Absolutely. Um, through our generous support through our community partners, the Hillsborough Schools Foundation and First Tech Credit Union, we were able to bring in Project Lead the Way STEM materials for our students to experience. Um, these materials really help our students to engage in problem solving and engineering and really take ownership of their learning. Mm. Another one of our community partners is Corvo, and mm. those STEM professionals come into our classroom so that they get that contact with a STEM professional and mm. really get to learn about what's possible beyond their time in K-12 education. And we've been really fortunate through that partnership that not only do they connect in our classrooms, they've connected outside of our school day. They come and tutor in our after-school program, and that really builds skills and confidence in our students and also a, another relationship with a caring adult. Uh, my name is Maureen Mybeck. I'm an engineer at Corvo, um, and I've been uh, volunteering with the kids in the after-school program uh, for about two years now. I, I absolutely love volunteering. I love um, seeing the look on the kids' faces, that they're excited when I show up every week, that they know <laughs> that someone really cares, that they're doing well. I really think it's important for kids to know that they're supported, not just by their teachers and their families, but by everyone in their community. And I think that you know, by being able to, to bring in you know, members of business to help them with tutoring or reading or math, whatever it is, um, that they really understand that the whole community is invested and when they are succeeding, that everyone's succeeding. You've got a lot going here at McKinney. Can you talk a little bit about um, maybe the extracurricular activities, anything anything else you're providing for your students, any other services or resources that you're providing for your students? Oh, there's so many. We try to do everything we can to extend our support beyond the school day, like I said before. Um, we can't do it alone. Mm -hmm. So we've partnered with the Oregon Food Bank to be an on-site um, food pantry, for example, and we do that the first and third Wednesday of each month. Mm -hmm. And we have families come from four to six and they're able to shop and just get the food that they need for their families. Um, and we just provide that right here on site. Beyond those things, we also have been offering um, different things for the students just right after school. Um, we work with Chess for Success has been a huge partner. We have a waiting list for chess. Mm -hmm. These kids get to go to tournaments. These kids get to um, participate in something that if Chess for Success wasn't partnering with us on, they wouldn't have had this opportunity any other way. Uh, after school programs that um, do Lego robotics, and we have Glencoe High School, which is you know national champion caliber robotics team, and those yeah. students donate their time to come here as well. Speaking of Glencoe, um, they send students to um, staff all of our after school and evening events for um, childcare when we have parents come, so that the parents can focus in on the work they're here to do. Um, so that's been huge, as well as supporting our. Um, fun runs and supporting our fall festivals. Um, so our community, what makes McKinney successful is really because of all of the community, not just McKinney. There are some excellent things happening here at McKinney and really proud of the work that you're doing. Best of luck to you as you move it forward. Thank you.
We've had a great time with our visit to McKinney this afternoon. We have hundreds of partners across the district that help our students every day. We've got thousands of volunteers that work and make a difference in the lives of our students. For more information about volunteering, please visit our website or contact our volunteer coordinators, Katie and Colleen. Thank you very much.